That's right guys, the bar supplies are out. No craft beer review today though. It's a beer cocktail or beer tail, so you know there's some craft beer in it. And what drink are we gonna have today? Today we're gonna have the West Coast Sunrise. The West Coast Sunrise is a play on a tequila sunrise. It's got many of the same ingredients. However, for bittering in this drink, we're gonna use a West Coast IPA, which is a pretty forward IPA. This one's super fresh, got plenty of hot bitterness in it, and that's gonna replace like our lemon or lime that you would put into the drink. So, without further ado, let's get started. First, we're gonna go with an ounce and a half of 100% agave reposado tequila. So we got one ounce. Now we're gonna pour this into our tin that I've got filled about, I guess a quarter of the way full with ice. You don't wanna water this down too much. All right, got a tequila addition. All right, next up, we're gonna have two and a half ounces of orange juice. So we got one. I'm using Donald Duck today. You could use fresh squeeze, but I'm lazy, so I'm not doing that. I got our buddy Donald helping us out. Okay, two and a half of that. Now I've already pre-measured this. This is two teaspoons of the juice from the maraschino cherries there. You could also use grenadine if you want, but this is a little more watered down and not as aggressively sweet as grenadine is. So put that right in there. Now, last but not least, we're gonna have two dashes. Let me get a bit of shake first. Two dashes of Angostura bitters. One, two. All right. So, time to get our shake face on, isn't it? We're gonna do 15 uh, shakes on this one. We want it nice and combined. Okay, now, we got our pint glass here, because it is a beer. So we're gonna serve it up in a pint glass. Let's get a bit of ice in here. They say fill it with ice, but I don't like too much ice in this drink. I only like to go about halfway in the glass because there's plenty of liquid in this shaker already. So, get this in here. So this is pretty much a tequila sunrise, but we're gonna go a little west-west today, guys. Got our West Coast IPA. Get a nice hiss off the top. And we're gonna do our beer addition. Pour it nice and smooth so we don't get a gigundi head and we can get as much delicious IP in there, A in there as possible. All right, now we're gonna garnish. Got a nice lime wheel, that'll look pretty. And a few cherries, boom. There you have it, West Coast Sunrise. You know how we roll around here. Let's get a taste of this bad boy and see what it is. Damn, that is rock star. Give this one a try, guys. I'm sure you're gonna like it. If you like uh, IPAs and you like a tasty drink like this, a little tequila sunrise action, this is a drink for you. Because remember, when you have a beer cocktail, you don't have to decide between a shot or a beer. You just have them both. So until the next time, guys, thanks a million for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. Until the next drink how-to, that's a big damn. Peace out.